Hello and welcome back to Sonem K for another video. Today's video is about Jabra Evolve 265 productivity headset that I've had for some time now and been using it daily. And if you've been planning to have a modern wireless productivity headset for your office or home office, this might be for you as I go through my findings. And here are some topics you'll find in this video. This will be a deep dive review, so let's get into it. Let's start with connectivity. It's connecting via Bluetooth. In the box comes Chapra Link 380 USB dongle. And there's more to talk about this dongle than you would expect, as it's actually preferred to use when using headset with computer, as it comes with bigger range of up to 30 meters or 100 feet. And normally you'll see ranges like 10 meters or 30 feet. But it also gives better sound quality as it supports A2DB Bluetooth 5.0 profile and HD voice. Jabra Link 380 gives you rich sound quality even when you're away from your computer. You'll also have compatibility with applications such as Microsoft Teams, Zoom and others as this gives you access to all available features like remote call answering. But connecting with Bluetooth without using dongle is possible as well. And Jabra Evo 265 headset is designed to work with your computer and mobile devices and it has dual Bluetooth connectivity, meaning you can connect two Bluetooth-enabled devices at the same time, including mobile device and computer. It can be paired with up to eight devices, but connected to two at the same time. Now, let's get into actual headset product itself and its design. These are on-ear headphones. There's this fresh, kind of modern look. It exudes quality when you hold it and it's well built. This one here is in matte black, but it's also available in beige. Headband is fully padded, all the way from top of the head to sides. Headband is not adjustable in the middle. You can adjust earpieces and they rotate and have some angle to have a snug fit. Earpads are large in size. And having memory foam material under the leather-like finish which feels comfortable. Chapra is saying about design that they've been using biometric measurements from hundreds of heads to achieve this shape. The earpads are lined with the perforated leather-like material. Chapra is saying that the memory foam oval ear cushion design cancels 48% of the noise around you. The overall fit is lightweight and secure, with plus silicon coated foam cushioning on the inside of the headband for added comfort. The right ear cup is where all the action happens. It has the microphone boom and it also houses all the buttons and status LEDs. First we'll find three button array on its side panel, with the middle button controlling playback, play or pause, and the outer button controls volume up or down and track navigation as when you hold volume up button for one second, you'll forward the track and holding volume down button will play the previous track. And this one single button is a mute button. You can just press down to turn it on or off. These are Microsoft Teams certified and it has a Teams quick button as well. The middle button in the ear cup answers and ends calls and it can be used for opening a Microsoft Teams notification and launching the Microsoft Teams app. On the lower part of the panel, there's power switch which is also Bluetooth pairing switch and you'll also find the USB-C connector for charging. An outer ring on the right ear houses a status LED which turns in red when you're on a call, so co-workers know not to interrupt. The Evolve 265 comes with a noise-canceling microphone that's made up of three microphone array and advanced digital zipset. This not only picks up your voice well, but it helps to remove unwanted sound from your background. Muting and unmuting is easy as it automatically unmutes when lowering microphone and mutes it when lifting it up. And you will hear voice alerts when upping or lowering the mic. And in everyday use, noise cancelling microphone quality is really good, as many of my colleagues are having the same headset as well. There's no crackling or distortion. Microphone does great job isolating your voice, keeping background voice to a minimum. We have talked about the earbuds and design, but let's talk about what's inside the earbuds and the sound quality. It holds 40mm drivers, and they sound great. I don't have possibility to measure frequency response, but from everyday use, I feel that there is good range of sound from the heights all the way to very deep lows. Of course, if you are having more music dedicated over-ear headphones, 
then these are probably not in same level. But for this type of on-ear professional headset dedicated more to conference calls, I found the sound quality to more than meet my expectations. And it does give a decent punch when there's bass in the tracks, and I sometimes find myself listening music after workday with Jabra headset. And there's Sound Plus mobile app that lets you have different boost modes as well, but more on that later in this video. But one thing to notice about these drivers and earbud design, that there has been reported of audio leaking, meaning that if you play your music at high volumes in a quiet office settings, nearby co-workers may hear what you are listening to and could be annoyed bit. Just something to bear in mind. And one thing, even though sound quality is great, I wouldn't take these outside when jogging or walking, as non-removable microphone boom makes them somewhat noticeable during casual use, and during jogging this probably wouldn't hold well in your head. Now, one important part is how comfortable these are in use. Weight is 187 grams. It's about average for this type of headset to weight. It's not really light, but not that heavy either. When wearing it, it actually feels good and maybe even lighter than you'd expect at first. But I have noticed that if you need to wear this all day, it starts to feel, at least for me. So that could be something to pay attention. Earbuds feel comfortable. Memory foam material under the leather-like finish feels good, but again it could be just me. But when having days when you have headset pretty much all day in your head, even these comfortable earpieces starts to feel a little bit. Like you need to take it off for just for a little while so you can continue again. So overall I would say these are comfortable to wear quite long time. Naturally there's some limit. A time period that's individual for everyone that's it might to start feel heavy or uncomfortable. But I would say that you can wear this quite long time at a time. Battery life is excellent, up to 37 hours. Let me repeat, 37 hours. So they don't need everyday charging. You'll find USB-C port for charging in the right side ear cup. It will take about an hour and a half to have full battery. If needed, you can use the headphones while they're recharging and you can have 8 hours of use with the 15 minute charge. There's also a charging stand accessory available. For computers, there's Chapra Direct software, available for Windows and Mac. And for mobile devices, there's Chapra's app Sound Plus, available for Android and iOS. Both can be used for updating headsets firmware and to have sound optimization for music with the 5-band customizable EQ. And you can access to many settings like for example disable or enable the PC LED. And something you'll only find from SoundPlus app is different relaxing soundscapes like ocean waves, rainy day, songbirds, or a waterfall and others. And EQ has more presets like bass and dribble boost modes, music focus mood and energized settings, and speech. But there's no need to download this app if any of these extra features aren't interesting to you as headset doesn't require to have app installed, but the app is easy to use and the EQ and soundscapes are a nice addition. So what was on the box? Besides Jabra Evolve 265 headset and Jabra Link 380 USB dongle, you'll get USB charging cable. It's USB A to USB C type of cable. And you'll get soft case, which is made out of fox leather and it looks and feels good quality. And I have found this very useful Naturally, it should protect your headset from scratches and minor water or dirt exposure, for example. But one thing about this headset is that boom microphone isn't detachable, so it could snag on something if you just throw them into a bag unprotected. So it's nice to have them in this case before putting into a bag. And case includes this small pocket for the USB dongle as well. Bear in mind though that this case isn't padded in any way so it doesn't protect against any bigger drops that might cause some damage. As conclusion, Jabra Evolve 265 is one great option as your wireless headset in the office or home office for conference calls like Teams or Zoom meetings. They are quite comfortable and have amazing battery life, so you should have no trouble wearing them for hours at a time. They support multi-device pairing. So you can listen to music on your phone while staying connected to your work computer, for example. And status LED, or busy light as Chapra describes it, which serves as a visible indicator that you're in a call is a nice feature. 
price for these is about 179 euros or US dollars. And if you made it this far, I hope today's video was useful. Please drop a like and let me know in the comments if you have any questions, experiences or if you're planning to have one. I'll try to answer all. Thank you so much for watching, have a great day and we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.